and um, it's been a couple of weeks since I think I last did a video and one of the things that I have noticed is that with all the training and everything, the upskilling, the trialing, the failing, the, the sloshy results, just everything and then you do it again and again and again and that repetition, that route of what you're doing suddenly starts making sense. Now, why I say that is last year I did a gold course training with SSM except I missed half of it because there were things that were going wrong on my side of things and I couldn't, I, I misunderstood so much and the training went on. So I went back and I practiced and I thought, no, I'm getting this all messed up. I'll connect later. And that is how I learn. Um, sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. It's just difficult being an autistic learner and oh, people think you're normal and you're just not going to be but I am normal in my own learning pattern so now that I've taken years of my life relearning after a vehicle accident relearning how to learn and then um, an overload and I had to do it again and then that was um, three years ago when I left work thankfully and then I have come into this particular upskilling, retraining, education program and I just went, whoa, fine, what hit me? But I knew that I would get through it. That's the point. When you know that you want something enough, you will put up with a lot. And that doesn't have to be the case, but if you know that there is something out there and it is right, there, you're going to just do what ne it needs to be done and you are going to do it. In my case, I came across Graphics Creator about October last year, maybe November, and it was rather sketchy, it was still in beta mode. I had a ball, managed to bust the system several, several times, but I sent queries and got to know the people at the other end and now what I have done is gone back into my training notes which I took screeds off because that is how I remember things and today I have in five minutes created the cover fold uh, Facebook cover thing for I think 15 pages I've got and tossing up whether or not I should put it on my main one but I've done Twitter and I have done Google the collections in there and I'm about to do YouTube and the actual Google Plus one as well. They're all the same and that avoids confusion so that when people come to one place and they go to another place, they know it's me. They know that what's on there is what's it, continuous with continuity they are getting the same messages and that is also very important if you are anywhere on the autism spectrum or if you are a carer of somebody somewhere, a parent, a child, a grandmother, whatever or even just yourself because you have to care for you. That may sound selfish, it's not. If you are not functioning properly then how can someone else look after you and get you through into the next step not that you need it but they feel compelled to and so that aggravates me as well but let it be move on let them see that you know what you're doing you are capable whoops there's a hole you fell down it learn to climb up grab it, go for it. Now move forward and keep moving forward. That is the way. Yes, you will louse it up. Yes, you'll do it again. 
you'll muck it up you'll burn the porridge you'll burn the cakes you'll go oh I was trying to do this let everything go just don't turn them on go and eat a raw apple but get what you need done and I think I've harped on enough so you have a very good evening day morning have a great time go and look at the graphics creator go and look at Susan Lewis marketing go and see the pictures there they're not fantastic but I feel great with them alright then as I said catch you later bye